there are many other ancient shipwrecks that have been discovered around the world. One of the most famous ancient shipwrecks is the Titanic, which sank in 1912. However, there are shipwrecks that were old enough that dates back into Greek, Roman, and Babylonian times. Let's check out the top 9 oldest shipwrecks that were discovered so far. This video is brought to you by Aura. More about this at the end of the video. The ninth oldest shipwreck ever found is the Antikythera wreck. This ancient shipwreck was discovered by sponge divers off the coast of Greek island of Antikythera in 1900. The wreck is believed to date back to the 70 to 80 BC. The ship was carrying a diverse cargo of luxury goods, including bronze and marble statues, jewelry, glassware, and pottery. Among the most significant artifacts discovered at the site is the Antikythera Mechanism, a complex astronomical device that is believed to be the world's oldest known analog computer. The Antikythera wreck has been the subject of ongoing archaeological research since its discovery. In the recent years, a team of archaeologists has used advanced underwater technology to explore the site, uncovering new artifacts and gaining new insights into the ship's cargo. At number 8 is the Madia Shipwreck. The Madia Shipwreck is an ancient shipwreck that was discovered off the coast of Tunisia in 1907. The ship is believed to date back to 80 BC. The ship was a large merchant vessel that was carrying a cargo of amphora. Among the most significant artifacts discovered at the site were a number of bronze statues and other decorative objects. At number 7, the Marsala Punic Warship Wreck. There are several Punic warship wrecks that have been discovered by archaeologists. One of the most significant is the Marsala Punic warship, which was discovered off the coast of Sicily in 1969. The ship is believed to date back to the First Punic War between Rome and Carthage, which lasted from 264 to 241 BC. The Marsala Punic warship was a largely galley-type ship that was equipped with a ramming device at the front. The ship's cargo consisted of several large stone blocks, which were likely intended to be used in the construction of a building. The ship also contained a number of personal items, including a sword and a helmet. The sixth oldest shipwreck ever discovered to date is the Karina shipwreck. This was discovered off the coast of Karina, Cyprus in 1965. The ship is believed to date back to the 4th century BC, most probably in 288 BC. The ship was carrying a cargo of over 400 ceramic vessels, which were used to transport wine and other goods. The ship sailed in the Mediterranean during the lifetime of Alexander the Great and his successors. She sank in open waters less than a mile from the ancient harbor of Karenia. The evidence points to her being taken by rough seas around the year 300 BC, when she was rather old, though piracy is a distinct possibility. At number 5, the Mazatos Shipwreck. This is an ancient Greek shipwreck discovered off the coast of Cyprus in 2006. The ship is believed to date back to the 4th century BC and was carrying a cargo of amphorae, which were used to transport wine and other goods in ancient times. It was located in the sea area of Mazatos, at 45 meters below sea level. The discovery of Mazatos shipwreck has provided valuable insights into ancient maritime trade and the economy of ancient Cyprus. The ship is believed to have been on its way to trade wine when it sank, possibly due to bad weather or navigational error. The Gozo Phoenician Shipwreck This is the fourth oldest shipwreck ever found, and this is an ancient shipwreck that was discovered off the coast of Gozo, an island in the Mediterranean Sea in 2007. The ship is believed to date back to the 7th century BC, and it is considered one of the oldest Phoenician shipwrecks ever discovered. It was found lying at a depth of 110 meters 360 feet. The ship was carrying a cargo of amphorae, which were used to transport wine and other goods, as well as a collection of weights and a large grinding stone, which were likely used for processing food. Among the most significant artifacts discovered at the site were a number of bronze and jugs, as well as a set of weights inscribed with the name of the Phoenician god Melkart. At number 3, the Bronze Age Shipwreck at Cape Caledonia. This is an ancient shipwreck that was discovered off the coast of Turkey in 1960. The ship is believed to date back to the late Bronze Age around 1200 BC, 
and it is considered one of the oldest known shipwrecks in the Mediterranean. The ship was carrying a cargo of copper ingots, tin, and various other materials, which were likely on their way to be traded with other civilizations around the eastern Mediterranean. Among the most significant artifacts discovered at the site were two stone anchors, which provided important evidence of ancient shipbuilding techniques. The anchors were carved from local limestone and were designed to hold the ship steady in strong currents and rough seas. The second oldest shipwreck ever found is the Illiburan shipwreck. This is an ancient shipwreck discovered off the coast of Turkey in 1982. The ship is believed to date back to the Late Bronze Age, around 1300 BC, and is considered one of the most important shipwrecks ever discovered. It was discovered close to the east shore of Yulaburin, Grand Cape, Turkey, in the Mediterranean Sea. The distribution of wreckage and the scattered cargo indicates that the ship was between 15 and 16 meters, 49 and 52 feet long. The ship's cargo is believed to have originated from various regions around the Mediterranean, including Cyprus, Crete, Egypt, Syria and Levant. And now the oldest shipwreck ever discovered to date is the Dokos shipwreck. This is an ancient Greek shipwreck that was discovered off the coast of the small Greek island of Dokos in 1975 at about 15 to 30 meters. The ship is believed to date back to 2700 to 2200 BC, and it is considered one of the most significant shipwrecks from the Hellenistic period. It is the oldest underwater shipwreck discovery known to the archaeologists. The shipwreck has been a subject of ongoing archaeological research since its discovery. The site has yielded valuable insights into ancient maritime trade and the economy of the Mediterranean region during the Hellenistic period. Anyone can find anything on the internet, including your legal name, your personal email, your home address, phone number, and even your relatives. This information is accessible because of data brokers, who profit by selling your information to robocallers, telemarketers, spammers, and anyone else that wants to learn more about you. That's why I'm excited to tell you about today's sponsor, Aura. Aura will identify data brokers that are exposing your information and automatically submit opt-out requests on your behalf. They'll even opt you out of junk mail and telemarketing lists. You can use my link below to try two weeks for free and see how many data brokers are sharing your information. Also linked in my description or scan the QR code. Aura also monitors your emails and passwords to see if they were involved in a data breach and exposed on the dark web and gives you recommendations on what to do. Aura's app also features a VPN, password manager, real-time credit and identity theft monitoring, internet parental controls and protects your device from all malware. Aura has almost every internet safety tool you'll ever need, all inside one app. Let Aura do the hard work of keeping you safe online. If you sign up right now, Aura will give you a two-week free trial with my link. You'll be shocked at how much of your private information Aura finds exposed over those two weeks. To start your free trial, click in the link in the description or scan the QR code.